but we went without many things for many years. Now, you're going to try to imagine what I mean. You can't even get close to how we had to deny ourselves. This is the first time I've ever said this. There were times my children ate and we didn't. I postponed haircuts for up to two, two months. I, I have trouble looking at, at my, uh, my pictures from the past. Your hair grows faster when you're younger. Think, Man, I let my hair grow too long. I flat out could not get a haircut. I remember one time we were so poor and I was systematically underpaid because of connections in my family and people didn't like me. We're going we're gonna, to we're gonna whittle down the All-American to where he belongs. And so we paid a certain price for that. But I remember one time uh, I got a razor blade and a razor blade would last, I had a pretty full beard, and it would last about seven or eight days. And I thought, I cannot afford a new razor blade. And I asked God, oh, what a serious prayer. Father, I, I can't grow a beard. I can't afford another razor blade. We were that desperate. And I wasn't going to be able to for months. That razor blade went six months. And as soon as I had a little extra money, it wore out like, like somebody shot it with a gun. I'd put it, I'd say, okay, here we go again. And I, would, I, I learned to shave in the shower where your, 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 your beard is softer. That's one story that lasted six months that God provided for us.